a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. John the Baptist appeared, preaching in the desert of Judea, and saying, Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. It was of him that the prophet Isaiah had spoken when he said, A voice of one crying out in the desert, Prepare the way of the Lord, make straight his paths. John wore clothing made of camel's hair and had a leather belt around his waist. His food was locusts and wild honey. At that time, Jerusalem, all Judea, and the whole region around the Jordan were going out to him and were being baptized by him in the Jordan River as they acknowledged their sins. When he saw many of the Pharisees and Sadducees coming to his baptism, he said to them, You brood of vipers, who warned you to flee from the coming wrath, produce good fruit as evidence of your repentance. And do not presume to say to yourselves, We have Abraham as our father. For I tell you, God can raise up children to Abraham from these stones. Even now the axe lies at the root of the trees. Therefore, every tree that does not bear good fruit will be cut down and thrown into the fire. I am baptizing you with water for repentance, but the one who is coming after me is mightier than I. I am not worthy to carry his sandals. He will baptize you with the Holy Spirit and fire. His winnowing fan is in his hand. He will clear his threshing floor and gather his wheat into his barn, but the chaff he will burn with unquenchable fire. The Gospel of the Lord The second Sunday of Advent focuses on the preaching of John the Baptist. Repent, for the kingdom of God is at hand. Our Gospel today shows how John the Baptist calls people for conversion by baptizing them in the Jordan River. In this account, we are given the glimpse of how John lived what he preached. His words and life witnessing are so powerful that drew people to repent and be baptized by Him. His example invites us to look at ourselves inwardly. He reminds us to gaze at our reality today, our lifestyle, thoughts as well as witnessing to others. We are invited to pattern them to the one whom we are waiting for, our Lord Jesus Christ. And as we wait, we are challenged to become more loving, forgiving, and more generous and sensitive to the need of others. Advent is an opportune time to renew ourselves for the Kingdom of God. Therefore, as in the message of John the Baptist, the coming of our Lord Jesus Christ into our world is not just to save us from our sins, but also to awaken the divine life in us. Let us learn from John the Baptist. Like him, we align our will with that of God. John the Baptist is not the light, but since he immersed himself in the light of Christ, he becomes a light to others as well. May we imitate his dedication to also reject Christ's light through our lives. A blessed Sunday to you.